Central Empire Wrestling presents Bridge City Slam 6 live Saturday, September 7th at the Bridgeview Center in Ottawa. Come see Jake the Snake Roberts, Buff Bagwell, former WWE Tag Team Champions Demolition, Real One Enzo Amore, The Powers of Pain, The Boogeyman, Snitsky, Jordan Grace, Cameron Brene, and the stars of CEW. Tickets start at just $20 and include the Fan Fest from 4 to 7 p.m. Get your tickets through Ticketmaster or at the Bridgeview Center in Ottumwa. It's Bridge City Slam 6, live Saturday, September 7th at the Bridgeview Center in Ottumwa. New Life Fellowship in Keswick, Iowa is hosting the Victorious Living Conference Friday, August 23rd through Sunday, August 25th with guest pastors Luke and Jana Hobbs from Tennessee. You're invited to make plans to join New Life Fellowship in Keswick for this dynamic time of anointed worship, teaching, and ministry. New Life Fellowship is located just south of Keswick on Highway 22. The conference schedule is Friday, August 23rd at 7 p.m., Saturday, August 24th at 6 p.m., and Sunday, August 25th at 6 p.m. We hope to see you for the Victorious Living Conference. This Saturday, H&S Feed and Country Store in Oskaloosa invites you to stop by from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. as they're hosting a celebration you don't want to miss. Join H&S Feed and Country Store as they mark 20 incredible years of service with their much-anticipated checkerboard day. There will be family fun activities, delicious food, exciting giveaways, and live entertainment. Bring your friends and family, and let's make this a day to remember as we celebrate 20 years at H&S Feed and Country Store in Oskaloosa from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. this Saturday, August 24th. Watch Pekin Panther football live right here this fall on Steve Shetler Media, Facebook, and YouTube with live announcers and an updated scoreboard, plus an area scoreboard to keep you updated on other schools of interest. It's Pekin Panther football live right here on Steve Shetler Media starting Friday, August 30th. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, this is Kevin Hempel with the Beacon of Hope uh, Project in Oskaloosa, Iowa. Uh, and I'd like to say good morning as well and good afternoon to the Steve Shetler Media team. It's been a while uh, since we've had a chance to have a conversation. But today, I hope everybody had a great weekend and a great week last week. And I hope you uh, all learned something from the encouraging message from last week. Uh, today, I want to talk about how uh, the importance of it is to rest and relax and also get things done that um, that you have kind of put on the shelf for a while. And so my wife and I this weekend had an opportunity to go do a lot of things on Friday night and Saturday and Sunday. Uh, what we chose to do was stay home with the family and actually get our life in order. And so um, you see right now I'm kind of standing in a small dark area. The light might go off, so that might trigger some message here. But um, this weekend I'm actually standing in my garage. Uh, and this weekend what we realized was that we had stuff everywhere like our house was a mess uh the uh upstairs bedrooms were messy there was laundry all over the place the garage had boxes all over the place we had extra equipment and extra things that happened from this summer now that the kids are back in school and what we decided to do was that we had the opportunity to go out and do things and have experiences with others but we felt the importance of um, pulling out the car and actually being able to wash the car and then pulling out our other vehicle and being able to wash that um, to organize the garage and it was a weekend of moving I'd say we probably worked anywhere from like 12 to 14 hours uh, each day however last night as we were sitting down for dinner what I realized was that how important it was um, to actually get the things done that we've had on the shelf for a while uh, for many years, our life was move, 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 move. Probably, it's been like that for at least 18, 19 years, but since 2020, we never really had the opportunity to sit down and go, okay, how do we get this together? How do we, how do we make this all work now? So uh, this week, I encourage you and I challenge you to take all the things off the shelf or look around your house that... Um, uh, for things that you've been kind of placing and saying next weekend I'll get to that or next tomorrow I'll get to that but never actually really getting to it um, in these moments of being still and listening um, to, 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 to where you're supposed to go and what you're supposed to do 
Uh, we can think that the rest that I'm talking about or others talk about is actually rest of doing nothing at all, when in actuality it may just simply be rest from doing all the things that you've been doing uh, that are deterring you from actually getting the things done that you should be getting done right now. Um, we're going through a cleaning season, and so right now we've been getting rid of things, releasing things, uh, uh, whether that be places we go, things we do, people we see, things we have. It's just been a full release um, so that we can then start to walk forward on the path that we know that we're supposed to and intended to walk forward. Um, I am in disbelief right now, but I'm going to go with it that the light actually stayed on because when I had pressed record button prior, it had been shutting off and I really thought that I was going to be delivering some sort of message about the light shutting off and being in a dark secret place. So um, if you hear that message, go towards that. If not, uh, be encouraged to just take things off the shelf and look back at your journals or look around your house or your car or wherever you're at right now, maybe you're at work. Pull the things off the shelf that you should be getting done that you kind of know need to get done, but you've been placing it there for a while. Um, and then proceed forward. And, and uh, I hope that you have a great week. I hope that everything is going well right now. And if it's not, just remember you're going through it for a reason. And so um, you may just be getting prepared for that next season. This is Kev Hempel signing off with the Beacon of Hope in Oskaloosa, Iowa. And we love you so much. And you have a great day.